Hey everyone, I'm at SFL Airport. Usually I take BART, but it is around almost midnight, which means I missed it. And so it says here, level two, hotel shuttles, parking shuttles, at base ride services, doors nine through 13 only. Okay, all right. So the problem is, if I take a look at this, right over there, there's no sign. And then if I go here, there's nothing telling me. It just says door 02, which means it's door two, right? Which means, I guess, it should tell me this. The signage here needs to be improved. That means I have to walk, what, uh, seven doors, I guess, to be in position to uh, get an Uber or Lyft ride or any app-based service ride that happens to be, you know, operational or not, right? Ugh. Um, when the people here lay out the signs, they've got to really do so with the idea, with asking this question. If I'm getting off a plane, what do I see when I get off the plane when I'm trying to get to a rideshare service, right? Or Air Trans, or BART, or in this case, Air Train, excuse me. This is good. Air train temporarily all of service, right? Shuttle to all terminals and rent a cars. Proceed to departure level SFO parking. Shuttle zone. Walk to terminals one, two, international and BART. Okay, fine. That's a long walk, but still it's a good start. And not only that, there is no excuse for not having at least some type of moving sidewalk system in here. You know? I mean, this is a long walk, and if you are... <sighs> If you're elderly, that walk is daunting. And there's nothing to say, hey, need a wheelchair? Call this number. Need a wheelchair? See this kiosk. Nothing, right? Uh, so people just sort of set these things up without actually thinking about how they're going to be used and how they should be used. They just do them just to say, okay, we have, you know, it's like, the, it's. I call it the bureaucratic defense mechanism. In other words, hey, we have this. We're already doing it. The question isn't whether or not you have it. The question is whether or not you're doing it well. And at SFO Airport, they're not doing it right. They're just straight out it. I'm at door six right now. I got three doors to go. TSA pre here, see this? If you, if you were to call or order your ride for Uber or Lyft or whatever, not knowing this, you would probably miss your ride, okay? Because of the walk from where you came from, if you got off at United at the uh, 60 gates and then had to walk to door nine, that walk alone will cause you to miss your ride share. Okay, so they ought to measure it out. Say, hey, look, this is how many minutes you have. Do not order your ride share before you get to door nine. <laughs> All right. I mean, you would think that someone said that's common sense, but yes, <laughs> when people are tired and then not familiar with an area, common sense sometimes goes out of the window because they don't know. So you have to give them a break. Anyway, at least they got the air train part of it right in terms of signage, right? But the other part is an obvious work in progress, folks. There's just no other way, no other way around it. So, so I had to walk to the old part of SFO Airport, right? <laughs> That's good. Okay, what door is this? Oh, looky, door number nine. But look, it does not tell me. Look at it, see? It says nothing about app-based services. Ah! Man, but this is where I call Uber or Lyft. So apparently I call here and I wait, like all these other folks are doing, right? But there's no obvious sign, okay? But I'm here, folks. So if you're ever at SFO Airport again, this is door nine right here take a look at united economy all right that's 10 over there all right 
this is where you catch it. The signage is awful. Share this video so that people will know. Hey, so as an addendum, I just ordered my ride, which actually is really cheap. But get this, the sign says doors nine to 13, right? Well, the lift says go to door six. So I gotta go all the way back down to door six to get my ride here, okay? I mean, <laughs> wow. This, this is door seven right here. door six okay so the signs do not line up re with reality they're picking people up all over the place and you're there so meanwhile SFO is saying well go to doors 9 to 13 and they're just sort of thumbing their nose at that signage that's got to change got to really stop there they have to really rethink this signage process it is out of line there's my addendum